I'm not buying another freezer right now because one that is not in my budget. Um, and the big, ref no, the big freezer is really big. It's huge. So it shall fit. So I'm going to Lowe's. And if I don't find what I need, which is some racks or something to go into that deep freezer to separate the uh, food, to make it easier for us to find, and I have to pull everything out when we're looking for something, then I'll probably go to Walmart. But we're gonna make it happen, and you'll see in a few minutes when I start moving things out of that deep freezer. So, y'all, it is still, well, it's not snowing, but you see, you see, it's, it's still snow on the ground, y'all. It's cold out here. But the sun is starting to come up. And I'm not going to let that make me feel bad. Because things are going to happen. That's why I keep checking your deep freezers every day. So you will know that it is still working. Because I should have known it was about to go out. Because it blew the socket, the outlet, twice. So, yeah, that was a sign. So, I will see y'all in just a few minutes. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button. What you waiting on? Please go on and subscribe, y'all. <clears throat> Most of y'all not subscribed. Y'all watching, but y'all not subscribed. And I appreciate it. And please, by all means, hit the like button. Because if I can get about a thousand likes, y'all, my husband, y'all hear him say, come on, let's go. <sighs> he turned into an old man. Bye, y'all. You don't rush me. Okay, y'all. So we made it back from the Lowe's. We got three of these containers here. It has a lid on it. And then we got three of these little small ones. And three of these plastic clear ones right here. And I got to pull everything out of this freezer. But I also have to get everything out of the smaller freezer downstairs. So... I'll be right back. So this is the smaller deep freezer. As you can see, we have a bunch of pork butt and some other items in there. And we need to get the vegetables out and put those in the standing um, refrigerator freezer. This is, this is how big this one is. Uh, this also has to come out. And I have to sort and put them into these containers. So let me get my camera on the stand so I can get started. Okay, y'all, before I get started, started, I wanted to say condolences to the actress, Regina King. Um, I just found out that her 26 year old son passed away. Um, so condolences to her and her family. That was her only child. I cannot even imagine. Um, but yeah. So uh, let's get into this right here. Y'all, I need some gloves because my hands are going to freeze. And I'm gonna do this on a fast track so that it's not taking up the whole time of me doing this. So let me find my gloves and then we can really get started. <laughs> Backwards, yeah And much your lover Who don't use big words, yeah I don't need convincing at all Because I know what I want Baby, can't you figure it out What's going on in your heart? What's it gonna take for you to love Take for you to love me? Think it's time you let me know What's it gonna take for you to love, take 
in here. Okay, so I didn't get to record the whole thing because it's hard to get anything done when you're recording. But we have two of these bins right here in there. And then two of these bins at the bottom. This one's labeled seafood. This one is breakfast um, food and sausages. And then what we couldn't fit, we got down in the side and on the bottom under this one we have chicken and the bottom under this one is beef and then we have our turkeys and some whole chicken well one whole chicken here the other whole chickens are in the bin and those are the ones we processed ourselves so this lets me know look y'all now i can see I'm low on butter. I need to get more butter. I need to get more of these juices and some more of these meals right here. But we got her done. I also forgot to add that in either this bin, no, in the beef bin under this, we have um, venison, deer meat. So my I don't eat it. My husband does eat it. I'm not gonna say I won't eat it because I've never tried it but my husband does eat it so we do have some of that in there as well so over in the refrigerator well the freezer part of the refrigerator in the garage I put my vegetables frozen vegetables we have down here at the bottom some broccoli and then I got some frozen hash browns and mixed vegetables um, some cabbage that I cut up and froze right there. And then these came out of the garden in, yeah, 21. May of 21, I believe. These came out of my garden. And that is squash. And then I also have some chopped up celery, bell peppers, different colors, black peas. Yeah, black eyed peas. I'm sorry. It's been a long day. Some green beans back here and then more mixed vegetables right there. So I can see these are all the frozen vegetables that I have. I do need to add to that as well. I'm really glad that I had to actually finally get this deep freezer somewhat organized. It's right here we have the ice cream. Right there, they can pick what they want. My frozen bread. Um, yeah. So, y'all, it was long, it was tedious, but it is done. So, I'll see y'all in the next video. Keep prepping.